Right now we're on the north side of Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania, at uh, Elkisan, we're the Allegheny County Sanitary Authority. We're the regional wastewater treatment plant for the city of Pittsburgh and around 80 communities in Allegheny County. The treatment plant itself works as we take all the wastewater from the city of Pittsburgh and the 80 surrounding communities that we deal with. And prior to us, it went into the three rivers. The uh, water comes in from those interceptors into our main pump station. We collect that, we pump it, we do a physical treatment at first, we remove anything bigger than three quarters of an inch. We remove all the rock and silt out of it, then we send it over to our primary sedimentation basins. The purpose of primary sedimentation, whatever's going to sink to the bottom of the tank, we want to sink. Whatever's going to float, we want to float. So the scum and greases, as you'll see, they start to remove themselves or separate and the sludge settles to the bottom and we deal with those two waste trains here. The uh, water from our primary sedimentation basins after it's treated gets secondary treatment. After that, it goes into a biological treatment. We actually use bacteria, which we call the bugs, to break down the water or the, uh, the waste that's still suspended in the water. This is the final sedimentation tanks. A lot like primary sedimentation, they're just circular. This is the last part of the treatment process where uh, the separation occurs. Then the clean water goes to the Ohio River. The bugs or the sludge that settle to the bottom of this tank go back to the aeration basins. We put it back to work attacking these suspended solids in the primary effluent. So this is the final step. That water that you've seen in the, in, the, in the wet well finally made its way here. On a day like today, 240 million gallon. It took about 12 hours to get through the plant. And we've treated it and we're discharging it back to the river.